call it my phone, I got options And I don't wanna tell you to drop me But I don't wanna play your face Hello Aries, so this is your weekly reading. This reading is going to be from this Friday until next week Friday. So let's see what's going on. And I will be uploading way more um, in November. So let's see what's going on. Okay. So universe, what's going to be the current energy between Aries and the person that will be on Aries line? Okay, we got the magician, we got your energy, so we're going to deal with the fellow Aries, Gemini, or Virgo. Um, but this is about manifestation. You see what else I'm getting. Universe, the person that will be on Aries line. What this person like to say to Aries? Queen of Wands, universe. Okay, I feel like there's somebody that's pissed at you. <laughs> okay. I feel like you got your power, though. You got your power back. The ball's in your court. Let's see what else I'm getting. Universe, the person that would be on Aries mind. What would this person? Oh, right after again. Universe, the person that would be on Aries mind. What would this person keep hidden from Aries? Nine of Swords. Yeah, Six Swords. So this could be someone that you just stop connecting with. Okay, they may feel like you did them wrong. They may feel like you play play with them. <laughs> okay, um, so they want answers from you. Let's see what else I'm getting. Universe, the person that would be on Aries' mind, how would this person feel about Aries, the Emperor? They may feel like, wow, so this is someone who's putting the blame on you. Okay, they feel like you want to, okay, this is how they're feeling. They feel like you're only putting your needs and your feelings in consideration, not theirs. So this could be someone you've broken up with, someone that you stopped dealing. I feel like this could apply to the male Aries more. Okay, um, this person is blaming you. You see what else I'm getting? Universe, the person that will be on Aries' mind. What is this person's true feelings for Aries? Five of Swords. Hmm. Five of Swords. Let's look at their intention. The universe, the person that will be on Aries' mind. What is this person's intention? Nine of Cups. They want you to be with them. Universe, the person that will be on Aries' mind. What actions will this person take? Two of Swords and the Lovers. Yeah, they want you to be with them. But they feel like you are playing them. Like you you have played them. Let's go back to the Five of Swords. Universe, the person. Okay. Universe, clarify the Five of Swords. Ace of Wands. Yeah. Okay. Universe, clarify the Ace of Wands. Page of Swords. The Death card. Wow. Okay. So this person's going to be trying to call you out, even though that's probably not the case. Like you didn't hurt them on purpose um, or you feel like you didn't do anything wrong. OK, they're going to be stating their piece to you. OK, um, they just blame you. But I feel like at the end of the day, they still want to be with you. <laughs> OK, so even though this person is blaming you. They still want to be with you at the end of the day. So this week coming. You're just going to hear them, um, I feel like ranting. So this person could have Aries in their chart. They're going to be talking to you recklessly, okay, because they're hurt at this moment, okay. Um, that's what I'm seeing. So this might apply more for the masculine Aries, okay. Um, but yeah, they can't get over you even though you hurt them or they feel like you hurt them. Um, they still want to be with you. Okay, so like I was mentioning, this person could be an Aries as well, could be a Virgo, um, could be a Gemini. There's Pisces here. So let's see. Okay, let's look here. Okay, so universe, give me a three card spread. I'm going to see you how for Aries. Okay, universe, give me two more cards. Okay. I'm also going to be doing all signs. It should be towards the middle of this video. Okay. 
universe give me a three card spread must just see you have for aries universe give me one more card okay so first position there is flute disappointment in a friend or lover so yeah they feel disappointed okay frying pan trouble accusation yeah they're accusing you or they flipping things on you okay then there is vine seek out information that will help you and then happiness hmm so you guys you may be feeling this towards someone else and i feel like what you're trying to say is more so seek your own clarity seek your own closure okay then there is the skull hidden secrets can harm you and then there is bear danger especially in money matters okay yeah so i feel like we're trying to say if you feel like you didn't play this person but they feel that way i feel like we're trying to say is like don't like don't even um don't even like um don't continue to deal with them okay because i feel like with them they don't see how they're responsible for how they they feel as well they're not they don't take accountability that's what i'm getting here so even if you just tell them tell them what it is they still gonna be blaming you okay so i feel like this person can be vindictive at times as well okay ladder climbing towards success wind chimes peace and harmony okay i feel like your um your career is gonna look very good okay for the rest of the year you're getting to the next level um, you also may feel very comfortable. Um, probably there was a time where you feel like, like to just say for business owners, you didn't know, like, um, if your business will get out of a certain phase, it will now you feel comfortable with it now. Okay. Um, but yeah, <laughs> when I'm getting here, I feel like someone might feel vindictive. Okay. Um, let's look at the other duck. First, give me a three card spread. You give me a three card spread. What messages do you have for Aries? Got strength in reverse. Oh, we got partnership and alliance in reverse. And seven of cups. And chocolate. Okay. So, yeah, for those who feel like, um, you didn't do nothing wrong they feel that way but it's okay like what you're trying to say is just explore your other options don't deal with them because i feel like this is someone who's gonna keep on blaming you and it's it's, it's kind of pointless let's just say you feel that way towards someone else it's trying to say like it's best to just cut this situation off with that strength in reverse and partnership and alliance in reverse and explore your other options okay you're gonna have better options okay you may feel like there's more chemistry with other options here let's look at this suck. Okay, so universe, give me a fake card spread. What messages do you have? Aries, all that glitters. Then there is exchanging gifts. And then clean it up. And here and now. Okay, so again, this person still want to be with you, even though it's not healthy, even though like you probably don't feel the same way about them. Okay. Let's see here. Okay, so universe, we have big cards. Bridal messages do you have for Aries? Okay, the hangman want to come out, but it went back and attack. You got your energy, the emperor. Universe, give me two more cards, the higher plant. So somebody gets done with the tours. And then there is Ten of Cups, Pisces, and Fire. You are the messenger, speaker, truth. You may have this in your chart as well. And then there is Don't Spend Too Much Time in Constipation, Fortune, Favorite Action. Yeah. So either or, <laughs> in whatever category you're in, if, if it is resonating, it's trying to say, get out. Get out so there's not more bad blood, okay? Because I do see the other person is vindictive. So 
it's best to just like cut your losses. Then there is, um, so there's strength in the verse, all thy glitters and the emperor. So keep trying that you have your power. Um, the ball is really in your court or the decision is really up to you. Then there is partnership alliance in the reverse and changing gifts and the higher fat. Yeah. So this person, they can be confrontational, but still want to be with you and still try to be your, still try to be your man or your woman, like giving those benefits. And then because of you not feeling the same way, they might, they might feel resentful and vindictive. Okay. So that's why I said, like, it's probably it's best not to deal with them at all. Then there's the seven of cups. Then there is clean it up, ten, ten of cups. You want the message to speak your truth and fire. Okay, this could become a soul tie if you continue to entertain this. And then your trumpet here right now. Don't spend too much time and cause patient fortune favorite action. Okay, it's trying to move forward to cut, yeah, just to detach, to not connect with them still. So let's look at the angel answers and the capital deck, and then we're gonna go to the all signs. So universe, give me a three card spread. What messages do you have for Aries? Recovery, compromise. Universe, give me one more card. Let go. Look at that. Look for a sign. Yeah. So the signs is there. It's trying to say let go. Because I think it will get worse and it will amplify. It will get more. It will escalate, basically. That's what I'm getting here. So it's best to just cut your losses and just move forward. Okay. So let's look at the Capra deck. Okay, so universe, give me a three cards. What messages do you have for Aries house? Okay, got adjudication and reverse. Universe, give me one more card and false person. Yeah, that's not really your person. Concern, yeah. So I'm trying to say, listen to those red flags. I said listen to, pay attention to those red flags. Listen to your intuition, okay. Um, universe, clarify house. This is a horizon expectation. Some of you guys are planning to move. I do see you moving. I feel like you're going to be moving around your birthday season, spring. Okay. That's what I'm getting here. Or you are going to be purchasing a new home as well. Universe clarified distant horizon and expectation. Thoughts. Yeah. So some of you guys are um, house shopping right now. Getting a realtor. Looking to see where you want to move. I do see spring. Spring is going to be that month. I said that month. <laughs> it's going to be that season. So let's look at the all signs. We're going to be starting with Aries. All right. So the universe is going to happen with Aries and Aries. Don't spend too much time on consultation. Fortune for action. Okay. That card keep popping up for you guys. So this could be general messages. Some of you guys have not been acting like yourself because um, Aries is very action oriented, but some of you guys have been like really indecisive. Okay, marriage. Probably this connection with a fellow Aries have been interrupting with you and, and like your focus, okay? So again, with a fellow Aries, this person wants to still be connected with you and you know that, okay. Let's look at Taurus. All right, universe is going to happen with Aries and Taurus. So there is Leo, Ten of Cups, and Repentance. Okay, so they want you to apologize to them, or that's you. Someone feel like it's one-sided. Okay, let's look at Let's look at Gemini. Universe is going to happen with Aries and Gemini. Fears will make you question it and mirror effect. Okay, a Gemini is actually trying to mirror you. 
courtship. So I feel like if this is someone that you was not exclusive with, okay, you didn't have the same feelings. They trying to show you that they don't care. Like they moving on. But in reality, they doing this to make you feel away. Mm -hmm. So let's look at um, Cancer. The universe is going to happen with Aries and Cancer. Okay, the okay, higher fun. Again, this person still want to be with you. Okay, universe is going to happen with Aries and Cancer. Message in reverse. Okay, probably they're not really expressing themselves. Okay, thoughts. Yeah, they're keeping things to themselves. Universe clarify thoughts. Mature woman and coffin. Yeah. So what I'm getting here, let's just say the ball's in your court and this person feel like you are the one that's hurting them or playing them. This person's still going to be connected to you and they just going to feel like, okay, that is what it is. Like, I still want to be with Aries. So it's like, that's what I'm getting here. Now, this could be vice versa or this is, could be like how they're thinking about you. Okay. But I still see them wanting to still be with you. Let's look at um, let's look at Leo. All right, universe. What's going to happen with Aries and Leo? Money opportunity. Oh, okay. A user. Main male. So they could be a user, or are they thinking that you're using them? Okay. Okay. Let's look at um. Let's look at Virgo. Okay, universe is going to happen with Aries and Virgo. Earth, the strength card, and Gemini, they want to talk to you. Okay, universe is going to happen with Aries and Virgo. Message, yep, they want to talk to you. You're going to hear from them. Let's look at Libra. Okay, so universe is going to happen with Aries and Libra. Right, your energy, Aries and Hill. Okay. Right, universe is going to happen with Aries and Libra. Coffin and Journey. So you guys really need to cut things off with Libra or that's how they feel about you. Okay, interesting with this one. The Libra is showing like they are trying to move on okay so probably the main um message the main spread with the tarot was picking up on how they truly feel okay so let's look at um scorpio universe is kind of with aries and scorpio got the fire new direction and the hangman so this scorpio want you to want them they want you to be stuck on them they don't want this to be over okay so let's look at Sagittarius. All right, universe is going to happen with Aries and Sagittarius. So many cards. Okay. The moon, the star, chariot, unparalleled, Scorpio, air, fool. This is new. It's a new Sagittarius. You also have a choice. Trust your intuition. Ten of cups. Fast lane needs water. Okay, that's good. So I feel like you guys are gonna be meeting a new set of shares. So if you click this, click on this part because of a current person or X, if you don't like your current person, it's trying to say there's a new energy that's coming your way and it's gonna feel like it's meant to be. This person could be a new set of shares as well, but it's just trying to say new energy here. If you have connected with a new set of shares, there's a lot of potential, okay? So let's look here. All right, so universe is going to happen with Aries that shares gift. Beautiful. So yeah, there's a lot of potential here. That's good. Let's look at um, Capricorn. All right, so universe is going to happen with Aries and Capricorn. 
clear vision you're right you um you always have a choice so i'm trying to say do what's best for you but not in like in a sense like you playing with people just do what's best for you like in the long run <laughs> universe is going to happen with aries and capricorn marriage okay universe clarify aries and it's like it's capricorn clarify marriage confident and high honor okay some of you guys are getting bored with a capricorn even though this is if even though this connection is not bad so you guys just need to talk more and understand like what's causing some issues why are you losing interest okay because it shows like this person if it is resonating it shows that they are a good person it's just that things have been lackluster okay so let's look at um Aquarius okay so universe is going to happen with Aries and Aquarius Hierophant oops The universe is going to happen with Aries and Aquarius. Expectation and Twin Libra. You know that this Aquarius is going to act this way. Okay. That's what I'm trying to say. <laughs> you know that they was going to act this way. Um, yes, they still want this connection with you. Okay. Let's look at Pisces. Okay. So universe is going to happen with Aries and Pisces. Ace of Cups. So I think it was Setcher. Setcher is good for you guys. Pisces. We got the Ace of Cups. That's good. Let's see what else I'm getting. Okay. Universe is going to happen with Aries and Pisces. Despair. What? <laughs> Let's see. Universe stuff by despair. Mature woman setting wealth and pathway. Universe called by Ace of Cups. Judgment. So, Lord. Okay. So, I'm going to read it both ways. The first way I'm getting here is one of you guys, if this is a newer connection, one of you guys need to get out of the funk. Okay. I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's something personal, not necessarily regarding a past love interest or past love connection that didn't went well. Um, so, that's what I'm getting here. They're going through something, but they need to have better coping skills so they don't self-sabotage other things that is actually good for them then also i'm getting here is um judgment okay so this could be about the past i feel like they could be a, um i say aries x they could be a pisces x that is feeling like they mess up big time i feel like they are really remorseful okay but they probably need to, they need to go through a journey that's what i'm getting here with that pathway and despair they need to like go find themselves okay have that dark night of the soul phase so they can be this mature person okay that's what i'm getting here so i see it could be a pisces x that's going through it emotionally since the breakup but they need to go through it because they need to find themselves i'm getting like that um hermit energy and the hangman energy which is pisces energy too they need to like find themselves more so they can be at their optimal self right now they're not okay so that's what i'm getting here so that's the reading that i have for you aries thank you guys for watching my video and subscribing if this video resonates you can definitely book a personal reading with me at queenfitero at gmail.com